Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing the new trend that's trending over, over everywhere where Google picks my makeup. So what you do is, Nikki Tutorial started it and I watched a couple of them. So what you do is, let me go on Google. So you enter the first letter of your first name. So mine is Miriam and the last name. So Michael and then you put look beside it. Okay, then you go to images. Oh, okay. So my first picture is this dress, this like pink dress, like a pink dress. So there's a lot of texture if you can zoom in, but it's one solid color. So I'm gonna base my makeup look off this. And since it seems a little bit simple, I'm gonna start with my complexion first. So I'm gonna be starting off with the First Aid Beauty Coconut Water Cream as my moisturizer. I am a little more on the dry side now. I'm gonna be going with the Dr. Brandt Illuminizing Primer. I will link everything down below. I'm going to be going in with the Makeup Forever Ultra HD in the shade Y255, mixing it with my, um, what is this one? My Maybelline Fit Me in the shade 210 Sandy Beige. I'm going to be going in with my damn beauty blender. <laughs> Concealer, I'm gonna be going in with the Sephora collection, the Bright Future in the color Palmier. CA translucent powder. I want to just go back in. So it's this dress, a lot of details, ruffles, but it's very, very plain. Just a blush pink. So I'm going to be back to Brazil palette. And I'm going to be going with the top pink shade right there. And shade next to just define it and I'm using the MAC 224 brush
English in the color party. My allergies have gone so bad this year, so it's like been a struggle trying to do my makeup. Because my eyes will get all watery. And then my life just becomes really hard. I'm not loving how that looks. I'm going to go in with the Pretty Vulgar blush and make them blush. There you go. So this is more of the color like of the dress. So it's basically an all pink look, which I don't usually do. I'm gonna go in with my Morphe brush, it's the R37. And I saw the color, I forgot what it's exactly called, but I'm gonna add some of this and the purple, I'll link it down below. I know there isn't too much purple in the dress, but I'm mixing it with the, the mauve shade. I'm going to be dusting under my eyes. I'm going to be going in with my Maybelline Fit Me Powder in number 230 and my Morphe E41 brush. I'm just setting the rest of my face. Next is take my BH Cosmetics foil eyes and I'm going to take a, like a pink foil shade, probably this one. Yeah, probably this one. I'm mixing it maybe with this one and take it with my fingers. And I'm going to apply it right to the center. So somewhat of a halo look, but nothing too dramatic. Taking it with the white, and I'm gonna apply it in my inner corner. I'm gonna take the Urban Decay Heavy Metal in Glam Rock and just place it right in the center. I'm gonna place some first and then just smudge it out with my finger. Taking a pencil brush. Well, actually more of a tapered brush is by Bedellium. Going first with those pink shades. Going back with my MAC brush. I'm just blending everything out seamlessly. So I'm going to be highlighting the, my brow bone. I'm be going with a Morphe brush. The M224. I'm going to be going with the same color, the white and the light pink as I used in my inner corner. Do I want to add a liner? I'm gonna do. It. I'm gonna take a liquid lipstick. Um, I'm gonna take the NYX bedtime for mixing it with um, honeymoon.
with mascara. I'm gonna be using the L'Oreal Telescopic in Black is Black. While I wait for these bad boys to dry, I'm gonna go on with my eyebrows. I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in Medium Brow. In Medium Brow. In Medium Brown, and I'm gonna be using a Eco Tools eyebrow brush. So I'm gonna take some product. Brow gel, I'm going to be going in with the e.l.f. Clear brow gel. I love this. With the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit in light to medium. And I'm going to be going in with my Morphe brush in M530. Mixing the first Contour shade and the last contour shade. And I take it up all the way, blending it into my hairline. Not a little more. I love me some bronzer. My chin. Whatever's remaining on my brush, I don't usually like to contour my nose too much. Then I'm gonna be going in with the Emrazy highlighter and a fan brush. Morphe 510, damping that as well. Going back with some more highlight. I love a lot of highlighter. Yeah, so for blush, I'm gonna be. I'm actually gonna be using the pretty vulgar one, and make me blush. I'm gonna add a little more pink than usual, and just blend it in with my contour. Bit hot black here in the color tease and it is a gloss and I'm gonna be placing some I'm gonna take the the vintage cosmetic club brush and it's the step two for the shadow that's what it's called take some of that and I'm gonna place it right in the center of my eye for a glossy look But I'm going to take it more than just the center, kind of bringing it in. Ooh. I like how that looks. I don't know which one this is. The name has rubbed off. But you can use any clear gloss there is. Ooh. 
Do you want to see how it looks? I'm gonna go in with Bedtime Flirt by Nex. So here is the final look that I came up with. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll be back with some more videos. Leave some comments down below of what videos you'd like to see next of me. All right.